Hi everyone, Linda G from Bellin Health. So for our Bellin Lifesaver Wellbeing series for the month of April, we are actually honoring National Minority Health Awareness Month. And so we're gonna do that by really focusing on celebrating our differences. So here are some tips and tricks to do that. So first of all, we wanna be aware that we're welcoming all ideas. Isn't it wonderful that everybody brings different ideas to the table and how boring it would be if they were all the same. So make sure that you're open to, to different ideas. The next thing that we really want to remember is that it isn't necessarily about treating others the way that, that we want to be treated, but really asking people how they prefer to be treated. And if you aren't sure how someone prefers to be treated, ask them. I'm sure they would be happy to share. So don't be afraid to have those conversations. The next thing we want to remind you to do is just to commit to continuous improvement. Uh, as, as wonderful as, as a lot of you probably are, there's always room for improvement. So keep striving. To, to move forward in that way. The next thing that we want to make sure we're doing is, is communicating and ed educating. So it's important to have conversations with people around you. If somebody um, is saying something that maybe you're not real comfortable with, it might be an opportunity to, to have that conversation and, and educate each other in that way. And then the last thing we really want to remind you to do also is make sure that you are communicating with your primary care provider about any differences that you may have in regards to your health. So if you have ethnic background or gender or age that lends itself to, to certain conditions, just make sure that your primary care provider is aware of those things so that they can um, give you the appropriate health care at the appropriate time. So for more information on this topic, feel free to go to bellandiorg backslash lifesaver. Have a great day, everybody.